So we're here with Jamie Lee Rattray, who plays left wing with the Brampton Thunder. Um, and we're just doing a quick video interview with her. Um, welcome, Jamie Lee. Thank you. <laughs> um, so we just want to talk about some of your biggest accomplishments. Um, first of all, most recently was congratulations for the Four Nations Cup. Oh, thank you. Team Canada, we just came back with gold. Yeah. Uh, you played extremely well oh, when we were there, <laughs> um, so congratulations for that. Thank you. Um, and also the Patty Kazmaier Award. Um, now you were, a, in your senior year, you played extremely well, uh, and that showed with that, you were receiving that award. Now that's NCAA Division One, mm -hmm. and that goes to the top player in the country. So that award says a lot for how you play. <laughs> Yeah, it was uh, definitely a pretty fun year. I mean, we also won the championship that year, so it was definitely a fun way to end my career. I mean, not many players can say they, you know, get to cap off their senior year with a year like that. And um, it was definitely a fun year. And, uh, you know, I think with an award like that or even a year like that, you want to ride that momentum as long as you can and kind of keep building on that as a player. And uh, it kind of helps your confidence a bit and you just want to keep building. Great. Now, the next thing we want to talk about are what are one or two things that you currently do in your training that are keys to your success? Um, I don't know. I think just the consistency. I think you gotta, especially in the summers, I think you gotta just be consistent with it and, you know, come come in every day and get better. And I think a lot, a lot of girls will tell you that. And, and during the year, I think, you know, it's, you don't, you, sure you don't be, you're not in the gym as much because it is in season, but every day that you're there, every day you gotta get better. And I think that's one thing for me is that I try to focus on is every day, you know, be consistent and you know, try to try to make it a good day. You know, you not very often you you don't want to step out of the gym and you know say that it was a, a bad day. So that's kind of the big thing for me. That's great. Thank you. Now, on that note, what is your biggest challenge, and how do you manage this challenge? Um, I think the transition to the CWHL. I think it's it's different than college. You know, you, your routine's different. You know, you gotta you know balance a lot more. Uh, I think that's gonna be you know the biggest challenge for me, at least uh, looking forward this year and. I think you know it's 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 exciting. It's an exciting challenge and a new a new transition, but um, that's definitely going to be probably one of the challenges for me. Great. Now, what was the best advice you were ever given? Oh, I think uh, I've been asked this question a couple times. It's probably from my mom. She just literally every before every game, she literally just tells me play your best and have fun. I mean, that's kind of what you want to take with it every game, right? You want to work your hardest and play your best and just have fun with it. I mean, if you're not having fun, then you know you know why why are you playing the game so. You know, she either sends me a text or if she sees me, she always tells me. So I think that's probably the best advice I've, I've, uh, I've had given to me. Oh, that's great. Now, do you have a saying or motto that you live your life by? Uh, <laughs> I don't know if I have a motto, but one of the quotes I like is, uh, go the extra mile, it's never crowded. You know, it's one thing that, you know, I kind of, I guess you could go by, I guess, you know, just, you know, there's not very people that are willing to go that extra mile or, you know, push themselves that extra you know a little bit so if you know if you know you're pushing yourself that extra bit you know that maybe someone else is and maybe you're you know getting better than they are so uh, maybe your opponent or something like that so I guess that's something that I could uh, go by great now where or who do you draw your inspiration from oh I don't know uh, I think my teammates I think um, you know if you see your teammates working hard and doing whatever they can to help this team be successful I think you can draw from that and you know as a teammate myself I try to you know you know exemplify that and work hard and hopefully help my, my teammates out in that way too I think you know as a team if you can draw from each other I think you're going to be successful and I think that's one thing that you know is big for me if I have teammates working hard I can always draw for them and you know you know use that energy that's great anything else you'd like to share with the Brampton Thunder fans <laughs> I don't know, come out for the games. <laughs> That's great. Thank you very much for your time. Good luck with the season and congratulations again for the Four Nations Cup. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you.